Good morning, good morning. I try to get the best night's sleep possible. It was mostly successful, but I definitely was awake. I Hello, multiple times throughout the night because today's the day. <laughs> I I think I'm mostly excited, which makes it just as hard to like sleep and whatever as being nervous. Um, but it's been a while since I've had like, and I know it's also mixed with a little bit of anxiety, especially because the way excitement makes you feel it, you know, you feel something different. It's not just your body's normal, like, feeling. And so, of course, whenever that happens, my brain is like, oh my gosh, red alert, something's wrong. I'm like, no, nothing's wrong. Relax. Like, it's a good feeling. Just stop. Um, so I think that's where most of, like, sort of the anxiety comes from. So I'm very excited. Um, I can't believe two and a half weeks has finally gone by to go and do this audition. I totally, like, was... It's not even like a big audition. It's just, I'm so excited and happy that I'm, I have the courage to go and audition for something that's theater again for the first time in so many years. And so no matter what happens with this audition, I'm really glad because it opens up the door and reminds me like to go out and do more theater auditions, you know? Like I have yeah. also given my coworkers express permission that if they see me, touch anything with dairy in it to knock it out of my hands because I might accidentally forget because some stuff has dairy that like I don't realize um even if it's not like dairy itself like for example a few days ago when I ate an oreo or two before rehearsing and I was like what and then I was like oh yeah the cream in it like yeah that's definitely um, anyway, so I cannot have cereal for breakfast this morning unless I wanted dry cereal and I don't. So I guess we're going with Eggo waffles, which is fine because I have them, but oh no, I can have my breakfast sausage things or my, my pancakes and sausage. See, because that's not dairy and really I wouldn't need to not eat it this early, but I'm taking all the precautions, okay? okay? No one really cares, but I did switch to waffles because I heated up one of the pancake sausage things and I don't know, it was weird. So I was like, nope, not taking that risk. It feels amazing out here this morning. I don't know what the temperature is, but it is gorgeous. It is 3.05, I did it, I made it through work. Uh, which went very well. I was really glad. It was actually a, a pretty chill day, um, which sometimes means time goes by really slow, but that was not the case this time, which was really nice. Um, went by at a decent, you know, pace. Um, I was more excited throughout work, and now that I'm so close to the actual audition, I'm definitely more nervous. Um, yeah, I, I'm more just like, I don't really know when is the best time for me to warm up. I think I'm going to warm up at home and then continue to warm up in the car. Um, just so I can get like the bulk of it done at home, but then continue to work my voice in the car. Because I'm basically going to leave here an hour before I have to be there 15 minutes early. So... So I have about, by the time I get home, I'll have about an hour until I have to leave. So I'm gonna change, make sure everything's in my bag, everything's sorted out and ready to go. And then I will warm up when I have like 15 minutes before I have also to leave. Also going to sing it one time through at home. I'm gonna sing it one time through in the car when I get there and that's it. Those are the only times I will actually sing oh, the song. Do you wanna hear something crazy? This place, first of all, is 10 minutes away from where I used to live. Two, it is in the exact same spot that Atlanta Workshop Players, who I used to work for when they were at the Brandon Hall location. But when I did that short film with them, when I was like 15, 
they were here. I have seen shows here. I know what the, I have rehearsed here. I have like, this is, oh my gosh, absolutely wild. What like a full circle moment to be able to come and audition here for a different company. So just anyway, so I've made it. It's 5.06. I need to be in there at like 5.15 is what they've asked. So I'm going to sit here, warm up a little bit more and we'll see how it goes. I will see you after the audition. So I did it. Um, I feel like it went pretty well. Um, I hit the last note okay, but not fantastic. But like I hit it. It wasn't like it was, you know, I cracked or anything like that. But um, I do think the acting side of it went well. And that's kind of what's more important to me is being able to show like I can sing, I do have a voice, but anyway. Um, so yeah, but I did have to say, cause they asked me, they were like, and are you willing to accept any role? And I was like, well, I was like, I put on the little sheet thing. I was like, Little Red is kind of the only one that's in my vocal range and is in my age range. So, um, you know, and he was like, yeah, I got to pull up my computer. And I was like, no, 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 it's all good. So yeah, I know that might affect some things, um, but if they look at the thing, they'll also see that I put potentially the stepsisters and potentially Rapunzel. But anyway, um, yeah, I am out of there at 528. So I arrived early and I left early. It was by ourselves. I'm very, very happy about that. Um, the acoustics in there are really great. And I, as I said, it's a pretty small theater. It's like a black box theater, but I think those are really cool. Um, so yeah, I've done the best I can. It's out of my hands and that's that. So now I'm gonna go um, head over to where I'm meeting my mom for dinner. Um, I'll be really, really early, but that's fine. Um, yeah, it is 742. My mom and I are leaving Mellow Mushroom and I am heading home. Um, I will say my body is, I wasn't feeling physically nervous in the moment. I was feeling mentally nervous, but I forget that I can't feel something mentally without also feeling it physically and my body is choosing now to be like now that it's over it's like now it's like everything it's weird it's just yeah I won't get too into it because it's kind of weird but yeah my body is just like whoo and I'm like whoa okay <laughs> what is that what are we doing so and now but it's also holding anxiety and 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 nervousness because as much as I it's not even nervousness of if I'm going to get a call back. It's when are they going to come out? Because I was telling my mom, I will have, if it is anyone other than Red Riding Hood, if I am for some reason called back for anyone other than Red, I am so royally screwed. It's ridiculous because I will have no time to prepare. Callbacks start at five for anyone who gets them tomorrow. They're five to nine tomorrow. I work until three, eight to three, and will have to leave the house by four to get to them if I were to get one. If it is a song that I for some reason do not know, if it is for anyone other than Red Riding Hood, I will be up very, very late tonight. And that is a sacrifice I'm willing to make, but like, holy crap, I didn't realize how fast it was gonna be if I am to get it. So that's more the thing, is I'm just looking forward to knowing so that I can then plan. But for the next two and a half hours, I am in limbo. I just had to share this strange moment. I'm driving home and I decided to go the way that has me past my old neighborhood um, where I grew up. And it was so funny because for a second, I don't know, I, I was kind of in my head and whatever. And I was like, forgetting that this is not where I live. Like I almost transported back to my like 17 year old self. Like, I don't know. Like I don't. And all of a sudden I was like, wait, no, I, I don't, I don't, I don't live here. Like this isn't where I live. It was the strangest feeling that I don't know if I can, I don't think I'm really putting it into words well, but it was seriously for a moment. Like I connected with my, that past self. And I was like, Oh, no, we're years past that. So I've made it home. It is 10, it is 8.25. I have set an alarm for 10.15 and I'm gonna go hide my phone. 
I am not allowed to look at my phone or in my email. I'm gonna have to be on my laptop, but it's easier to not be on that. Um, I'm gonna hide my phone. I'm not hide it, but I'm gonna put it somewhere that I cannot grab it. Um, so that way I'm not torturing myself. And I'm assuming if I have nothing by 10, 15, then I don't have a call back and that's fine. But I'll see you then. Well, it's 10, 15. I don't have an email. Um, so that's kind of what I was expecting. Um, I wasn't expecting to get a call back. Um, I'll check again before I go to bed because I guess it could come later, but probably not. Um, I weren't, I wasn't sure if they were going to send something out to everyone, but I figured probably not because they wouldn't want like, yeah. Anyway, um, am I bummed? Kind of. I'm a little bummed. Um, but at the same time, I just, you know, it's okay. It wasn't meant to be and it's all good. So huh, now I'm just like, I'm just glad that I know. Like <laughs> I just, I was sitting here for so long being like, oh my gosh, like this is driving me insane. Um, so like just, I was, as I said, I put my phone away because I was like, you're not allowed to check until like 10, 15. And I'm glad I did that. But um, yeah, I guess too, it's just, it's still going to be, until it hits like 11, just because I guess it could take them longer. Um, but probably not. I think it's been sent out. So, you know, it is what it is. Anyway, I am heading to bed. Um, it was a great audition experience today. I'm really, re as I said, I'm really, really happy I went. Um, you know, always good to go to more auditions. I'm proud of myself for going. Um, and... Yeah, I'll just I'm just gonna keep an eye on what other shows are going around going on around me and maybe we'll continue to, you know, try out for some more. Um I'm really looking forward to Friday getting to help cast the other the show from um my alumni high school. So I'm really looking forward to that. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed on social media is in the description. Love you all.